Weather Authority local weather forecast. Welcome back, and as we take a look outside right now in our RV World Yuma Skycam, very beautiful as we get ready to head into our evening. We're seeing plenty of sunshine and clear skies all around, so very beautiful conditions, but we are feeling a little bit warm out there, so let's go ahead and bring up our temperatures. So warmer for this time of year, normally 98 is the average, and we are seeing a low 100s for the majority of the desert southwest, so currently Yuma's 103, 104 in Welton, and 102 in El Centro, so we are holding on to those triple digit temperatures for the afternoon. So we are going to continue to have temperatures just like this, even heading into our Wednesday. And the reason for that is because I'm tracking a ridge of high pressure. So it is going to be keeping our temperatures above normal and on the warmer side, but we aren't going to be dealing with excessive heat. We are just going to be just a few degrees or so above the seasonal average. So we'll continue to have these warm conditions for the first half of this week. But what I'm really tracking is this trough of low pressure up to the Pacific Northwest. So that's something I'm going to be looking out for because that's what's going to be bringing us changes in the coming days. So again, tomorrow will be on the warm side, might see a little bit of clouds, but going to continue to stay dry. But as this trough of low pressure continues to move more down to the south, it will bring cooler temperatures later this week. So we are going to be having cooler conditions arriving as early as Thursday, and then it'll continue to see our temperatures downtrend for the rest of the week and into the weekend. So we are going to be seeing temperatures in the 80s. So after Afternoon highs are going to be rather enjoyable later on this week, but also coming with that will be breezier conditions. So I'm going to be tracking some winds. But in the meantime, our afternoons are going to be warm, but overnight is going to be pretty fantastic. So as we look ahead for this evening, we'll see our temperatures drop down into the upper 80s around 9 o'clock. We'll stay nice and clear with our skies. Dew points will be hanging out in the 30s. Winds also going to be light. So it's also pancake day. So even though we are past the breakfast hour, you can still have pancakes for dinner if you'd like. So if you want to dine in or out, very great conditions ahead. And as we now look ahead on our eight day forecast, running out of time. So let's go ahead and take a look at that. So low 100s for now. We'll see those double digits again. Look at the weekend 80s. We are going to be pretty cool and comfortable for the first day of October. So that's something to look forward to. Overnight lows are going to be pretty cool too, but look at um, overnight low through the weekend. So I am tracking some upper 50s potentially for Imperial. So that's definitely not a typo there and then we'll see um, low and mid 60s for the rest of the day so temperatures will be cooling down